Hello everyone. So today let us see with respect to the general telemetry system how actually the telemetry system works the general block diagram what are the components it will present how the signal will be transmitted how this non electrical quantities will be converted to the electrical quantities how it will be measured how it will be transmitted whether the transmission happens with respect to the line connection or wireless connection with respect to sensor and transfer we'll see it today so basically what is telemetry so telemetry is defined as a technology which allows which allows user to collect information from an inaccessible and inconvenient location and to transmit it to the accessible place to process to record and display the information in the presentable form so the definition itself states that i have a signal something where i have a signal here let's take one sine wave type i want to collect the signal where the signal is available in a remote place in a remote place so i want to access the signal okay uh, from this remote place and i want to process this signal i want to record the signal i want to display the signal in the present form right now it is not actually in a proper sign way i want to present in a, a proper sign way in this way so whatever the signal is available i want to convert this in this form so this is where the telemetry will work here okay so let us see how actually the telemetry system will work with respect to the block diagram that is called as a general telemetry system so initially it consists of a measure end so where the measure end could be your uh, signals signal which is basically a non electrical signal so it could be your mechanical signal it could be pressure it could be your force acceleration or displacement etc etc so these are the measure end where i am going to measure with respect to the sensors it will be measured here so this is the first input stage this is my first input stage where i am going to measure the signals with respect to non electrical signal using the sensors so this measure end will be primarily given to the primary detector so where the primary detector will detect based on the signal which is available what i am supposed to do whether i want to convert the signal or i want to transmit the signal directly or i want to amplify the signal or any kind of things i have to be incorporated so that primary detector will uh, detect that so after the primary detector so the telemetry transmitter so we this is actually intermediate stage within the intermediate stage, there are three uh, block blocks you can see here telemetry transmitters or telemetry channel or telemetry receiver so whatever the signal you received here have been measured here so this signal will be converted which will be given over there and it will be transmitted so where the transmitter will consist of different kind of transmitting devices are there which you can see in the types of transmitter in the next slide so this transmitter will be used to transmit the signal using the channel so this could be your wire or wireless wire or wireless so anything any kind of a transmitter channel can obtain over there so using that wire or wireless the signal will be transmitted and the transmitted signal will be received over there so where once again the signal will be converted back to some of the form which was originally available finally it will be given to the recording stage that is called my output stage where the output stage is a end device basically it consists of a, a recordings or indicating meter or displaying boards or it, this signal may be used for a controlling purpose also so this is how the general telemetry system will work over here so coming to the next part so these are the types of telemetry system basically the telemetry system are of two types based on the connection and which i am doing here so based on the uh, link between the transmitter and receiver whether it is a wire type or it is a wireless okay and based on the forms of information transmission so here this is actually a wire type so this is my wireless 
virus here. Here based on the information, the name itself is suggesting it is my uh, unlock type and the digital type. Where I want to transmit the unlock signal or I want to transmit the digital signal, I will be having converters. I can convert unlock to digital or digital to unlock converter. Based on that, I can transmit the signal. So this will be the purely based on the information whether it is an unlock or digital transmission. Here comes uh, between the link as I mentioned. If it is a wire type, there are three types voltage telemetry system, current telemetry system, and position telemetry system. So these are the three types of wired connection with respect to the DC. In all the three cases, they make use of a DC source and there will be a connection from transmitter to the receiver, there will be a wired connection. Hence it is called a landline DC telemetry system. Coming to the next one, wireless, it is a radio frequency telemetry system. The RF signal will be transmitted wireless from the transmitter to the receiver based on the frequency telemetry system or pulse telemetry system. So based on the frequency in terms of hertz, megahertz, this will be transmitted or in terms of a pulse which will be generated, uh, pulse modulation technique. So those three techniques will be used to transmit the signal. These are the different types of telemetry system. So with respect to the basic. So this is with respect to the general telemetry system.